Yes, Dave. Go ahead. Yes. Okay. Uh, well, uh, I'm uh, addressing my question first no, to the BITF. Anyone from the BITF may, may uh, answer. Because uh, yesterday I asked uh, Attorney Kat uh, if uh, the BITF already received uh, communication about uh, from the SB of Clarin uh, asking the BITF to probe the uh, allegations against uh, Mary Barra. So I just want to get an update if the BITF already uh, received information or is the BITF aware of uh, the allegations uh, being leveled against Mayor Ibarra? Um, Gov, permission to answer that one? Yes, go ahead. Um, early this uh, afternoon, I received a copy of a resolution handed to me by one of my staff entitled Resolution Earnestly Requesting the Bohol Interagency Task Force to Conduct an investigation or an in-depth investigation of Mayor Eugeniano Ibarra for violation of Executive Order 54 and Executive Order 97. So, mauning gi refer ni mo, um, Dave, no? Yes, so, yes, uh. yes. We have received it. It's dated January 12, pero uh, nadawat lang ni sa akong office um, after lunch this afternoon lang yun. So, um, as for the action, we will refer this first to the PLO. Uh, to determine whether there is such a violation. But um, there's, there's a reference here made um, that there is a violation of Executive Order 54. So um, I guess a perusal lang sa ato ang Executive Order 54 and compared to the allegations, maulang man ang kinihanglan po tanawon um, sa, sa kuan sa the BIATF ug sa PLO pod. So I would uh, forward this um, resolution to the PLO first. Okay. So uh, with the PLO, uh, is the PLO already uh, aware of uh, the circumstances? Uh, if uh, Attorney Ahat is around, uh, perhaps he can answer that. Oh, okay. Wala si Attorney Ahat. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much. Uh, my uh, next question, I would like to address this to uh, Dr. Yul, if Dr. Yul is around. Yes, that's Dr. Yul. Yes, Dr. Yul, uh, good afternoon. I just want to get an, uh, an update.